Alrighty, Scorpios, this is going to be your mid-March 2019 love reading. Thank you guys so much for joining me back on my channel. We are going to get straight into your messages for the rest of March. Alright, Scorpios, love life for mid-March 2019. Your feelings for your person, the challenge this month, the guidance, and the outcome. Okay. And give me one romance angel card for my Scorpios when it comes to their connection for mid-March 2019. Okay. So we have soulmate energy here right off the bat so this is interesting you guys are definitely dealing with someone who you have a deep soul connection with okay um you guys may be like i said dealing with a soulmate this could be somebody who you have kids with or someone who you may have a childish kind of relationship with for some of you guys like this person may make you feel youthful for others of you you may have children outside of this connection and it may be also affecting this relationship but um i am seeing that you guys are getting to know this person and you guys may need to keep an open mind because this person may be different than your usual type or what you're used to and some of you guys are trying to see if it is safe for you to love this person okay um, before we go into this reading, if you do want to check out the extended version of this reading, the link will be listed below as well um, on Patreon. And if you do want to book with me, you have until March 22nd to go ahead and do so. After that, until the 25th, I will not be taking any bookings. So you will have to wait until uh, the 25th for my bookings to open back up. But um, going back into the reading, your current feelings, we do have the Wheel of Fortune clarified by the Nine of Swords. So there may be a turn of events that may leave you kind of anxious. Um, okay, there may be some sort of turn of events. For some of you guys, you may feel as if like luck is turning in your favor in a good way. And it's really making you anxious though. Some of you guys are not used to... Maybe this type of person. For others of you, like it may have came in so fast as well like this person may have just like came in rushed in and it happened so fast and it may be leaving you anxious for others of you you may be wanting things to get to a better place like if you guys did stop talking for some time <clears throat> you may be wanting to communicate with this person because they may be like in and out of your life okay but the challenge here this month is going to be the Emperor. So it may be a Aries or a Taurus, but clarifying that we do have the Queen of Wands and the Queen of Swords. So it may be the fact that somebody has options just overall, the fact that we have a whole bunch of people cards in the challenge position. Um, so there may be a lot of other people here. Um, also... Yeah... So the issue may be like getting control over a connection with possibly, like I said, a fire sign, air sign, whoever. Maybe you need to clear some things up with someone and maybe you need to pick which person you're going to be with in the first place because it seems like suitors. But what I am seeing for the guidance, we do have the page of pentacles and clarifying the page of pentacles, we do have the nine of swords. So the guidance here is for you guys to make sure that you guys are dealing with somebody who's going to offer you enough more than a friendship, more than just a bare minimum. Um, and make sure that you guys are on the same page for what you guys want out of this connection in the first place. All right. But yes, I feel as if there is a chance for you guys to get a really strong connection going here with possibly a Libra or for you guys to make a connection right. But some of you guys may be really stuck in your head. Or feeling kind of trapped, okay, not even stuck to your head, trapped to a circumstance, like trapped to whatever issues you guys had or not really knowing how to get out of the situation. So I guess you could say stuck in your head. 
But um, for the outcome, we do have the Ten of Swords. And clarifying the Ten of Swords, we have the Moon and the Tower in Reverse. So the outcome, Scorpios, I am seeing that there may be an ending to a connection here. For some of you guys, this may be like you guys mentally coming to a realization that a situation needs to end so that you can avoid a tower situation for your best interest. And you may be taming yourself and going into your own space. For others of you, a relationship's ending here because there may be secrets and like I said, you want to avoid that. But let's go ahead and see what's going on with the cross watcher. What's going on with my Scorpio's cross watcher? Their current feelings, the challenge, their actions, what they want my Scorpios to know, and what they wish was different. And give me one romance angel card for my Scorpio's cross watcher for mid March 2019. Okay, and before we get into the cross watcher, give me one card for my Scorpios for mid March 2019. Okay, we have two cards. It says tantrums are for babies. Grow the fuck up. <laughs> And then this card says, fuck feelings, okay? You have logic for a reason. Use it. So, yeah, I really feel like you guys, um, you may be emotionally distraught in the second half. Make sure you don't get emotionally distraught with the situation that you thought was going to turn a different way and it didn't, okay? Just make sure you guys aren't. Um... Also, if you do get upset with the person that you're dealing with as well in this time frame, make sure that you are displaying your emotions or your communications um, in the best way possible, especially with the Mercury retrograde. You just don't want to come off the wrong way or say the wrong thing. But that's what I'm seeing for you guys. Thank you guys so much for joining me. That's going to be it for this reading. We're going to go on the other side and finish it up and look at your cross watcher side and just everything they have going on as far as their feelings, the challenge, their actions, what they want you to know and what they wish was different and also their feelings here. So I'll see you guys later. The link will be listed below as well as my link for readings and I'll see you guys in your next reading.